A curved array transducer with an abdomen exam type is used to perform an ultrasound-guided paracentesis. It is easier to perform this exam when the bladder is not filled. The patient is placed in a supine position. The abdominal cavity is evaluated in two planes. Place the transducer in a transverse position with the orientation marker to the right. The transducer is placed at the lateral border of the rectus sheath at the level of the umbilicus. To evaluate the abdominal cavity for free fluid, sweep the transducer from an inferior to superior position. Fluid will appear hypoechoic or anechoic and accumulate in the lateral gutter and between loops of bowel. To obtain a long axis view, rotate the transducer 90 degrees with the orientation marker directed to the point of needle entry. Sweep the transducer across the abdominal cavity from left to right to evaluate the abdomen for free fluid. A needle insertion site should be chosen in the lateral abdominal area in a dependent area of the fluid collection, which is clear from loops of bowel. The needle should be inserted lateral to the rectus sheath in a transverse fashion to avoid the epigastric artery. Follow the needle entry by slowly sliding the transducer in the direction of needle advancement. The needle will appear as a small bright hyperechoic dot. When the needle tip appears, the transducer should be advanced a short distance distally to follow the tip of the needle trajectory. The needle is slowly advanced under direct ultrasound visualization until the tip is seen to indent and then puncture the parietal peritoneum. The transducer should be moved slightly proximally and distally to confirm location of the needle tip.